Yeah, yeah. Because, you know, the, the last time we left off in Celeste, um, the jellyfish was a new mechanic. And we're probably going to have to get real cool with it real fast. Um, I've been told that Farewell is definitely the very last chapter this time, um, so I'm not going to get debated by another another chapter to do, but it is kind of a culmination chapter in that it's usually, it's, it's really going to turn up those knobs of difficulty. Um, and it can be as long as like two or three chapters. So I know even though we got part way through it last time, um, it's probably going to take most of the strep. And then, uh, and then we will be done with Celeste. Oh, thank you for the head. That's a raw right. That's what, that was my ground, there we go. Okay, so... Um... Try to remember, we need to do, undo all these locks. First thing is we needed to do... We need to turn off some of this electricity. Um, I thought we had gotten a... Yes! Alright, so we had made some progress. My big conniption now is getting the jellyfish No, that's not how I did it. How did I do it? Um Sick? Um, it could be I, I've been fiddling with the audio and moving it into a different position. Um, it's a little bit cleaner than I like. Like, there's that, there's been like a kind of weird, boomy kind of thing. I need to have, I think, both my double jumps. Oh, gotta get up there. But, um, I think the one thing I did turn off was one of the layers in the microphone. Um, there's, just, there's like a, I, honestly, I just straight up follow the guide. I don't, I don't know, I don't know audio engineering. It has like, ugh, limiter and then noise removal and then, um, a compressor and then all these other things. And, uh, it got me, like, got me about 80 to 90% of the way where I was wanting. But that, I've been trying to scrabble that last 10%, um, sometime the other, the other week, I got, um, Huh. I got this like little. It's basically like a um, um, kind of like a box with a bunch of foam in it, sort of thing. Ah, fuck. Just a cheap little box, little thing, to hopefully kind of isolate a little bit like around the microphone itself, just because it seemed a lot more potentially cost-effective than like a bunch of sound panels, because I can't really do that. I'm kind of in a big open room. I didn't grab it right. I think that's the thing. I think I need to throw it at that. Bounces off. And then I need to j jump, dash, grab, let go, grab. So I can go straight up there. Oh, I missed it. I haven't heard of a blanket, but it's like, let me see again. 
I do have, like, the fact that I can switch my desk between sit and standing has always made it... Fuck. It's made me leery of a lot of... Like, I know I could DIY, like, a giant, like, wall. And then I could put sound things on that and have that, like, right behind me. But I would need it to be something I can move because, you know, I don't want something static taking up a lot of space. Um... My, um, I just killed myself. My, um, I mean, I, I, I figure like having a soundproof sort of wall behind my, uh, computer system would work, would be nice. Just because that is pretty close to a wall, but it is a lot of, like, windows and... There's not a lot of space back there, I think. There's a lot of wires. No! Come on, Jelly. I need you to hit that. Grab. Oh! Crap. Okay. Yep, I need to, I need to do it twice. Hmm. Yeah, I would need to have, like, some kind of frame or something to set up. And yeah, that's the thing, is that like it's it's money I could budget for sound, but like when I've already got it to like 80 to 90 percent of what I care to have it at, I mean eh, I kinda would rather put that money to something fun and cool. thought about taking this anywhere. Uh, I feel like I really gotta hit those... Exactly. The Endless Library. Actually, hold on. Maybe I could do that. Hit this, hit this. Okay, so if I throw it... Nope, that's not it. I don't know. I don't know what I was thinking there. Ah! This is this is this might take a little bit of practice because I need to throw dash grab. Throw dash grab. Row dash die. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, this is this is so dangerous. Why did they leave all this electricity everywhere? Okay, that was embarrassing. I uh, I played myself there. That was my own fault. Ah! I usually download them, um, just so I have them locally, but also there have been a couple that I want to do a little bit of extra editing, um, before I, like, post them on, if I'm posting them up on Twitter. Ay, 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 ay. Ay, One frustrating thing I did have while editing um, the VODs is, um... Fuck. My subtitle tracks were just not playing nice. And I think it was because the Auto CC basically is making a bunch of, like, two to five second or so chunks. Basically in between every time I'm speaking. And, um, over, like, an hour-long 
series it ends up with a lot of little chunks and then trying to move them at all um, the program basically exploded I so I have my auto CC which actually saves like a local file um, I can't remember like the file type it's like SRT or something which is like the like the standard for CC And, um, hey, Dolly, welcome on by. It's pretty nice seeing you play a bit of Noida today. That is a fantastic game. Okay, um, I kind of want to see if maybe I can take this jellyfish in a different direction. Before I keep, because I feel like I'm, I'm, my brain is a little bit too tiny. I'm, it might just be I need to practice because, as I've been told, this is going to be at the upper end of difficulty um, when it comes to executing Celeste mechanics. Nope, up there won't be anything. But um, yeah, so this SRT file. Um, I might as well just reset. Um, I expected to be able to import it into the video editing program and have like 70 to 80% of my work done as far as, um, the, uh, the process. You know, obviously it's not one-to-one. -one. I imagine I'd have to go through and clean it up, maybe adjust times a little bit. But the fact that they end up as like, hundreds of little blocks and like the editing program I'm using it's it's free so you know I'm getting what I paid for <laughs> it's it's pretty pretty simple um, so like for my basic video editing needs it's fine but just the load of trying to move those um, sub uh, subtitle tracks around just it, I just could not get it to work. Um, I might just need to figure out a process. Um, the program is called Olive. And it's being developed... Open source? Openware? I don't know. I ran... Like, I tried... I want to say... I think it was, like, Blender, maybe? When I was first doing... Oh, really, like, way, way, way long ago. Um, and I, it was suffering just to get a short little thing with Blender. Nope, I don't think it's that way. What if I do this again? But, um... Uh, Olive is... That's right, I need the electricity so I can use other fucking... Hmm. I'm pretty sure I've gone through here, but I don't remember. Oh, that's probably just going to take me around so I don't brick myself. Hmm. We gotta jump, dash, dash, grab. Up, grab. Up, dash, boing. Grab. Grab. Yep. And just go in a big ol' circle. Alright, so that's not the path we need to go. We need to go up these. Um, I... I've, I've probably heard of DaVinci Resolve. I think I found Olive, um... It was some other streamer were working on a video live. I think it was Dice Queen D. And she was doing her, um... D&D Rant series. Um with the whole Wizards of the Coast fiasco. Oh, oh I'm so close. Oh, I need... Like, it it makes me go up at an angle, so I'm like, how the fuck am I supposed to get up there? I don't understand. 
Hmm. I mean, wizards or wizards. Hasbro basically caves. Let me let me take a sip of coffee real quick. I need some I need some brain oil. Wizards basically cave because of backlash, but honestly, like I don't. A lot of the uh, oh oh that's so cute. Oh, we got another bot. Oh, my second bot. Oh, it's so amazing. Bye. I would have, I would have, I would have taken, taken a screenshot, but you know, number two is not number one. Yeah, only my second. Not popular enough for them to constantly attempt to get in. Ay, 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 Zordon, no. Ah. Uh. Is there an area I'm maybe missing? <laughs> Your first chatter was a bot. Well, ain't you come a long way. It was... It's pretty fantastic to see... Uh, see your anniversary stream. It's pretty crazy. How far ye have come. And if y'all haven't gandered Dolly, why not? She's an honor on the internet. Check her out. Oh no. There we go. Aw, oh, the sound effect didn't trigger, did it? Okay, at least y'all heard it. I, uh, that's right. I was in a bit of a rush and did not do my audio, audio checks. So, I will not be able to hear any of my fucking alerts or sound effects. Oh, I hate that bug. Really wish OBS would fix it. Oh. No. No, I heard that just fine. No, that's working. Oh, that's, yeah, that's great. That's, that's, that's fantastic. Cool. <laughs> so, so I don't get otter noises, but I'll get baby crying noises. Is that how this is going to be? <laughs> oh, I hate it here. <laughs> See, I need to go up. I need it to go straight, straight up. Am I getting distracted by the jellyfish? Do I maybe need to use just double jump? Actually, hold on. What if I use the jellyfish to get up there and have double jump? Maybe that's all I needed. Maybe I'm overthinking this. I, you know what, I fucking am overthinking this. Yep. I, I see it now, I see it now. Ah! Alright, alright. Yeah, that's, that's what makes this so... Oh. Okay. We got ourselves a, um, 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 not a murder mystery, a, uh... Ah, fuck. Yeah, especially because, like, the main game of Celeste didn't really have any huge, um, I try, there's like a term for this. I'm thinking like point and click adventure game puzzle things where you have to get, you know, all sorts of stuff from all over a section of the map. What do you do? Oh, ooh, they have to be hit twice. I see. All right, now this well is our oyster. Okay, what do we got now? What about over here? Okay, okay. There is a key. 
No, jellyfish! <laughs> Alright, this might take a little bit. It's it's the release dash regrab that sometimes gets me. There we go. Whee! How nice of it. All right, we got one key out of five. <laughs> yeah, get him. Okay. Um, what else? I think there's something else this way. Maybe? Nope, that's just death. Alright, cool. Cool, 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 cool. What's this for, then? Can I go left? Is there anything left and down? Ah! Ah! <laughs> death! Pog! Alright. Jellyfish, you can fuck right off. We're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna be a solo, solo hero. Oh, I don't like how this looks. Yeah. Um, does, okay, so I'm, I, I'm guessing the jellyfish hits the button. Let's try this again. So jellyfish. I can do the throw. Okay. 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 I'd uh, I'd uh, I'd be a little bit more patient. I'd wait for it to come back before. Hell yeah, brother! Two down. We're rooting tooting now. Um. I don't know what I was doing there. <gasps> yes. <laughs> okay. So we definitely need to go up something. You know what? Let's let's go a little bit of left and left and twice. So there are a lot of similar sound effects. So there could be like gasp male, gasp female, you know, that kind of thing. Um, so it may not have. It's also um, at the mercies of the way I randomized it. I'm not exactly 100% certain um, how effectively random um, what I what I used is um, but it's random enough all right yeah we're gonna why why did they put the fucking viewing thing in such a dangerous area okay so we got a key up there So we're basically going to be boinging back and forth from the arrows. So I need to hit left, right, 
release grab to get vertical, maybe? Bounce. Refresh my dashes. Bounce. Oh, I do not like this section. So I'm going to have to bounce off of that. Release, grab, bounce in that middle area. And then start going left again. Release, grab, bounce one last time. Release, grab. So I'm going to need to do like... Um, I think I need to do like six or seven successful release grab. Okay. So, um, I've already put, um, because this is my first time video editing, I didn't do a lot of extra effects. I did do some camera zooms, especially in areas where... Uh, oh, shit. Oh, that's ads. Um, I guess I'll wait a second. <laughs> well, just... Ooh, I gotta, I gotta do this a lot faster than I thought I gotta do. Alright, this is gonna be spicy. Not like, you know, the cat spicy. Spicy execution. All right. Dash grab. No! Oh! I gotta, gotta give it a little, go get it a little, a little extra, a little extra. I wonder if I could like let go, let it bounce and then grab it. Hmm. Not getting me. Aww, she wants to murder me. <laughs> nope, that will kill me. But Drecky, that kills you. Hmm, I don't know how I can get over that spike wall. Feels like it's not getting enough height. There we go. Oh god, that's gonna be so hard. <laughs> Hold on, I can't practice it much. Oh. But um, Aurora, the um, so like the vods are mostly just cleaned up a little bit, and um, I did like a little bit of zoom effects. Like, ah, oh, I need, I missed it. I need to catch it so I can. Um, just mostly for me to get more familiar with Olive and just general vi video editing stuff. I missed it. Um, Alright, I went up instead of out. I gotta let go instead of just dashing. Fuck. But for the, um... Because, like, a lot of it's, you know, fading out. Effectively, um, all that stuff, and I also realized like somehow I didn't have enough height to even get the, the double jump. Okay, it certainly feels like I'm missing some nuance as far as how I get height with the jellyfish. It's like sometimes I'm like that, and I don't get high enough. I don't know if I need to, like, wait until closer to the end of my dash. That makes it go higher. Or maybe I need to... Hold on. Maybe my thing is I'm dashing diagonal and I need to dash up. And I'll get the vert... I'll get the diagonal from the jellyfish's jellyfishness. Damn it. Uh, but, like, while I was getting, while I was scrubbing through all of the VOD footage, 
I did, I had kind of, kind of like a little idea percolating. So I made sure to make a copy of every, like, scream. <laughs> and I'm thinking, I think I'll put them, put them to a funny, funny song. Like, uh, like, uh, Hall of the Mountain King seems like a classic. Where you, where you punch a scream every crescendo. Or, um, maybe Beethoven Symphony 5, I can do the same thing. In my head, it, uh, it looks pretty neat. But I, I gotta, I gotta figure out which screens make the cut, and... What stays on the floor. Ah, oh, man. I'm, I'm regressing. Let me hold on. So if I nope. So that gave me no height. That gave me a good bit of height. That also gave me a good bit of height. Yeah, so like for an example, um, on that scene, I remember in particular, I did, I had like a, uh, I had, I think I did like a, a slow zoom in to me doing the I'm a plant thing. <laughs> and, uh, and then it like snaps back out once, uh, the scene's over. It's so like little things like that, or, um, bits where I spent like, Two or three minutes of me sitting there just um, philosophizing or making guesses or something like that. That kind of, basically, like if I'm if there's not really any if I'm at a pause screen, there's not really any gameplay going on. I try to zoom in on my face just because you know that's the that's the currently active thing in the scene. Um, makes sense. Although, I did realize my zoom in OBS, like, if I want to do any kind of zoom in effects, and I have any, like, changes to my OBS scene, it's a nightmare to try and... Fuck! Untangle. Mmm. Man, this room, this room does not fuck around. <laughs> oh, man. And this is uh, not an optional strawberry. Bounce, bounce, jump. Keep dashing up instead of releasing. No. Bounce, bounce, release. Dash. Nope, didn't grab it. Didn't grab it while I had momentum. Missed it. I think another thing is I need to get tighter on my release and re-grab timing. I think I need I think it needs to be like almost instantaneous. Like that. I did I throw it backwards? Celeste, please, please. Come on, Celeste. I've got my little jellyfish right here. I have... I have like a, a dedicated hard drive, but it's certainly starting to get pretty damn full. Which is also a reason why I'm trying to... Um, Stop procrastinating and start converting them into VODs so I can get them off my computer and have Daddy Google worry about the storage. Because Bezos does not like it. Yes! <laughs> I have saved every VOD.
because so like the thing is like I I've been budgeting for for a long while when I did my last computer upgrade and I knew I was going to want a uh, I believe my local recordings are just 720p. And also the if it's streaming, I can't remember if it, if it is streaming at 1080p, that is a recent thing. I think I I think I upped that just to see if I could <laughs> kind of. And I was like, well, if I can if I can give it to the maximum quality, why not? Yeah, and I mean, they're still, they're still fucking, oh my god, the files are still huge, especially, like, I put all, I put the Soma, so Soma was about, I think that one came out to about almost 10 hours of gameplay. Um, so, the VODs, plus the edited down ones, which is still basically a duplication, um, all in the folder is almost like 32 gigs. So, um, once I do the scary, short little scary vid, I'm probably going to, like, zip all that up and, like, figure out an external storage solution. I am a little bit of a data hoarder because I'm, I'm paranoid that, oh, maybe, maybe I'll need that file. Because it's, it's happened to me. Mostly with scripts, though. So, probably not so much on videos. But, I don't know. I'm paranoid that, like, I'll end up in a situation where, like, I really, really want the unedited raw video file again. And I would like to have that on hand. I could also see it... As like, oh man, this is so hard. Yeah, because like, the thing with storage, storage is always um, the slower. I don't know why I'm not getting enough height. You know, maybe I need. Well, no, because if I dash off of that. I'll get too much height, maybe. Fuck. The slower the storage uh, makes the price per byte drop precipitously. And you can see that if you compare like the same size... Um, what's the latest SSD? The, the, in, the NV, NVMe SSDs? Compare like a one gigabyte of that to a one gigabyte solid state drive and it's also why like tape drives are still used in backing up large data because um, yeah it takes fucking forever to read a tape drive but it's cheap as hell and you can store a hell of a lot why why, why, where am I losing height? I, I am, I am missing something crucial in the amount, and what's giving me height with this jellyfish? Yeah. Oh, oh I need to think. And ultimately, honestly, I could just grab my old computer's hard drive and like nuke them. No, I can't. I have to let go the dash grab. Oops, didn't get saved. Or wait, no, I don't. I suddenly. No, I think I. I think I'm using my old hard drives. I don't think I actually have extra hard drives lying around. I think the only thing new I got on this one was another little solid state just to put VR games on because I'm I'm a person that has their OS on a tiny little solid state just for super fast booting 
and I thought I would grab um, another little solid state. It's not like I have a lot of um, VR games to begin with. Mostly it's just like Half-Life Alex and... I don't know. Is Phasma a VR? I keep meaning to get Phasmophobia to maybe play with some people. Ah, like, I can dash. <laughs> I love the jellyfish on the rising block. <laughs> yeah. Although, after Soma, I am definitely not playing another horror game on Friday. Like, this Friday. Not ever. <laughs> definitely playing more horror games. <laughs> oh no, I have, I have not played Phasmo, um, and I have not really seen too much gameplay. It's because it seems like it's a, it's a bit of a game where, like, if I knew how things worked ahead of time, I might, um, might ruin some of the fun. Did it add a bunch of stuff? Alright, um... Okay, I'm, I'm gonna take a break from that one. So I'm, I'm, I'm just not getting the consistency down, and I feel like... The old, the old puzzle game strategy of when you're stuck, um... Give yourself a breather and come at it later with perhaps an adjusted frame of mind. And maybe some of these other jellyfish puzzles will, um let me practice better because I like I, I see what I need to do but the actual execution of it is really not working for me and I gotta say now that I'm thinking about it this seems like a not a tutorial but sort of a forced hey here is the various ways you can use the jellyfish because I'm noticing each of these puzzles is kind of different and is asking a little bit of different technique um, when it comes to utilizing the jellyfish in like, you know, throw, dash, grab, jump, or jump, grab, um, successively. And then there's the, you know, hey, you need to use it to gain height. Um, and it looks like this one, I need to throw the jellyfish, dash, dash, grab. All right, so we got Dash, dash, grab. Grab! Ah, I gotta grab it while I still have momentum. Come on, Drecky, you gotta grab it when you have momentum. Ugh. I mean, I do. Mostly because it's like, there's not a lot of things to play in VR at the moment. At least, not a lot of multiplayer. Like, for multiplayer VR, you kind of have Pavlov. I think there's another first-person shooter that is not too bad in VR. Um... I would like to. I would like. I would like to at least replay Half Life Alex, um, because I actually. I, I. I believe I originally streamed that um, a very, very long time ago, like without a VTuber, just to a couple friends, um, just to show them. Um, just kind of show them. They were they were kind of on the fence about VR, and they were curious. I'm like, eh, I'll play Half Life Alex. Um. Oh, Beat Saber. Beat Saber is also a good one. I don't think I would ever. <laughs> I don't know if I would ever actually. Yeah, you know, maybe, maybe, maybe I could. I could use the exercise, and that would be pretty motivational. And I think there's like some interesting stuff as far as like maybe chat can send um, songs at me, but I'm not. Thing is, like I, I used to be a big um, rhythm game like DDR and um, the uh, the computer version that used the arrow keys. Um, 
And it's like, I don't, it's not really competitive, but I get really, I want, I want to do very well at them. Um, and it's really frustrating when they can't execute, and it's like a physical limitation, because I'm just not fit enough. <laughs> But it is good exercise if I can if I can get consistent. I've kind of I have not been as good about cycling consistently this year as I would have. You are playing Omori. That's fascinating. Softer. Uh, uh, oh, oh my. <laughs> that's a that's a that's a sound effect you ran on you landed on. <laughs> oh. But uh, I hope uh, I hope you had a I hope you had a great stream of Omori, Omori Kasara. Oh, I hope you had a great stream of Omori Kasara. Um, I know that game does have some heavy topics in it, so if you need to self care, um, and really, you know, streaming's hard work. You should self care anyway. Um, and you know, I know one of you, at least one of you, has been holding in your piss. Stop doing that. Go leave it in the bathroom. That's where it belongs. Grab a fresh cup of water. Stretch a little bit. I'll still be here. <laughs> uh... Oof. But uh, for, for those of you who may not know, I am a Draconic Serpent, a ground, a flightless dragon, or simply a worm. You're playing games on the internet. Today we are finishing question mark Celeste. Um, we're on the very last chapter farewell. I've been told it is as long as a couple chapters combined and also very difficult. And so far, I can agree with all of those. Son of a bugger. Why is there a secret down here? Okay, so I can see the whole map. Alright, so that's the one puzzle I haven't done. But I'm missing something. Hold on. One, two... Three... Four... Where's the last key? I'm one key short. Maybe something's gonna happen as soon as I get that last key. Maybe, maybe, um, maybe Goth. Maybe the Goth will return and it'll be like a boss run and I gotta use the jellyfish to run away or something. Okay, so I guess there is no taking a break from trying to solve that puzzle. We gotta, we just gotta, we just gotta go in and go at it whole hog. Huh. Ah. Try this again. Oh, ah. All right, all right, all right. We're doing good. We're doing. We missed it. We're just not getting all that height sometimes. Let's try and bounce some more. Nope. I will just leave the jellyfish on the block. It's people needs it. Nope, nope. Not good, not good, not good, not good. Not what I meant to do. What if I grab it and I crouch? Okay, I can fall fast. Wait a minute. If I hold up... Is it falling slower? Mm -hmm. 
I think it's falling slower. Ah. Um, I definitely want to play it again. Um, I might ping. I might ping. Beyond again, because I would like to. I would like to play either Zomboid or maybe some more Plate Up. I've been having fun with Plate Up. I've not played played it as much as I would like. I feel like I'm gonna need. I'm gonna need that black, black gold of coffee to get through this. All right, so let's test this. So no, just directional. You hit the wall right there. Now if I use up, oh man, that's a huge difference. All right, I don't, I don't like that. Even if I can understand it, so I need to, I need to basically hold up the whole time. Oh, I think that's where, I think that's where my big height difference is coming from. Oh, but now I am not getting it at the right time. It's so weird, because it seems like sometimes it gets me a lot of height, other times it doesn't. You're killing me! At least the spikes are pretty to look at. You know, we got that going for us. Alright, so we're back, we're back to... Back to that. See, that works. I'm trying to practice here. Come on, game. So I can grab it like that. Why is it not working up there? Like that. I stopped moving. That would have worked. Nope. Alright, I'm still missing something as far as... Oh! Ah, I stopped moving. As far as what is determining my height. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Wait, what? Uh, what? But... Actually, you know what? What if... Whoops. What if I... Not what I meant to do. Hold on. Yeah, I wonder if I could bounce, bounce, hit that third one, throw the jellyfish backwards, dash to hit the button and get double dash, and then on the way back, Dash, grab the jellyfish, bounce. Uh, uh, maybe, maybe like throwing it backwards is the big trick I need to remember here. Yeah, I think that's it. If I, if I hold this, so I'm going left, and I just let go, it's gonna go right. Also, give me my jellyfish back. You know what? No! If I hit restart chapter, I would have cried. Okay, so... Yeah, if I let go 
or if I do jump in the opposite direction. Not what I meant to do. I can do that. So if I throw it backwards, hit the thing, dash. So here, throw it backwards, hit the thing. Hmm. Interesting. Obviously, it's not going to work on these first two, but I'm, I'm trying to think of that middle section. Well, maybe I just need to get more consistent about getting to that middle section. And then I, I give it the hat again. <laughs> oh, don't you remember the days where all I had to do was just grab onto the moving block? That's all they asked for me. It's all they ever wanted from me. Me more height. I too much height in that case. Hmm. Nope. Nope. All right. Come on, Drecky. Come on. Come on. We got. We got to shake up. We got to shake up the deaths. You know. You gotta make sure you gotta make sure it keeps it fresh. <laughs> Alright. Getting to the second part a little bit more frequently. But now it's a problem of we're missing the cherry blossom. And we definitely need that double jump. Maybe, maybe like a speedrunner doesn't need that double jump, but I am not that good, so I need this. I need the double jump. All right, all right. Ayo, ayo. Ah, ah! I was so busy. I was so busy. Oh my gosh. Ah. Iris, welcome on by. Thanks for the recent subscription. Three months? Damn, holy fuck. Wow. It's already been three months since I hit a since I since I hit affiliate. Time time fucking flies. Holy shit. Y'all are amazing. I keep throwing the jellyfish backwards. God damn it. Just throwing it back. Ugh. Uh, 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 uh. I let go, dash, grab. Drecky, you gotta let go forward, dash, grab. I am doing pretty dang fantastic. Not as much sleep as I would have liked. Um, I kinda was really, <laughs> uh, what I say, I had the sudden inspiration to do video editing to make VODs of my Soma gameplay. Um, I stayed up until like 6 a.m. on Friday and Saturday. So like, I basically had four hours of sleep. Um, through the weekend. <laughs> uh, getting those put together. Ah. But, hopefully the next time I work on some VODs, probably Celeste. I feel like Celeste would be a lot easier to slice up. Because Soma is pretty continuous gameplay. Celeste has a lot of good, like, fade to black areas from me dying. That, like, I can easily be like, hey, this segment's getting kind of. This segment's getting kind of long. Let's, uh. Let's cut it here. Go to the next video.
But uh, how are you doing today, Iris? I know you are probably a busy, busy little person. I think uh, you hit. You start in the stream yourself, and I think you got. You got affiliate. Wouldn't be the first time my memory. I'm mixing people up, and my memory's jank. But uh, yeah. It's always nice when more more people are getting into the game. Because I think streaming is really rad. But I am an IT person. So online is my kind of ah! digital third place. No! Shit. Yeah, I took a nap today before, before stream. It helped, that's for sure. But I can't always depend on being able to sneak in a nap during my work day. Yeah, see, you're the smart person. You you waited until you hit affiliate. Maybe because you're 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 already confident. Uh, I I didn't expect to be streaming to anyone <laughs> for a good few months <laughs> or even longer. Um, so I was caught off guard, but uh, I got a fistful of emotes from people I like um, before I even hit go live. Oh, thank you for the boobs, Akari. Welcome on by. Um, I'm finally back into a situation where I have more emote slot, emotes than slots. Because unfortunately, old Bezos capitalism gating my delicious, delicious emotes. Like the G in lasagna. That's clever. <laughs> oh, that's clever. Well played, Akari, well played. Yeah. And I know if I was actually good at, what is it, marketing? Branding? Um, I would have saved until, like, my official, quote-unquote, debut lore video thing that I've been planning. But... I kind of, as soon as I get new things, I immediately put them in. So that's why you suddenly see, like, the sub-badges and, um, bit-badges things. Yeah, like, I think at most, all I might do is I might take my clips and then just do, like, either straight work them into YouTube Shorts or maybe do a minimal amount of editing. Because I know there's a couple, like... I think the one I did like a quick edit with was um, the uh, the that crystal heart, that first crystal heart I got with the bird puzzle where I had to like dash in various directions. Not what I meant to do. Um, when I when I dashed into it and it killed me, I was holding down my button. Um, I did like a I did like a little snap cut to my face, bang boom, kind of hee hee sound effect. So like a lot of a lot of little like jump cuts and short little sound effects, I can maybe like slap onto some clips and add some hashtags, and that's a YouTube short. Bada bing, bada boom, baby, get in that algorithm. Yeah, I'm really I'm really struggling. Um, what's that? Snap cutting to my face? Yes, eh? you know I. I do feel like, so usually when I do that zoom, it feels like it was making my VTuber model very pixelated, but um, I'm trying out, um, oh, thank you for the boobs. There's actually, there was like a recent update to VTube Studio that adds a, it's a, I don't know what the fuck it is, it's like Sprout 2. I don't actually know what it is. Um, 
but um, <laughs> it it's a different way. It's like a specific plugin way of um, capturing VTube Studio in OBS rather than using like an application capture or something. Supposedly, it's more resource efficient. Um, my eye was more drawn to the fact that it doesn't like. I have like various the you know, VTube Studio has like various UI buttons and stuff. I have them open right now. And you don't see them, which is a nice little feature. So I can just leave like you know the item things, or if I need to lock all items all of a sudden, I can just do that, and it won't obstruct the uh, the streaming thing. Which it's it's a little, it's so minor and it's so little that I love that a lot. But it also feels a little bit better quality. Sometimes I have enough height to hit the cherry diamond. Other times I don't. And like, I realize I need to hold up. And that slows how fast I fall. But I feel like I, I am just not getting the nuance of the dash jellyfish grab to maximize height. I don't know if it's like I need to be more quick in like let go dash grab or if I need to tie or if there's like a different timing. Um I actually already have the VODs up. The Tihi screen video, I'm that's probably gonna take me a minute. Mostly because workday and I'm I, I might get distracted working on it. Um, you know what? I think that's it. I think I just need to be better about. I need I need a I need a tighter tighter I need to be tighter on my let go dash grab because that's getting me so much more height. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I think I, I think I figured out my problem. Okay, not that fast, Drecky. Um, I guess I do need to add the uh, the YouTube VOD channel to the yeah, socials. Ah! All right, progress. We're making progress. Ah, we lost a little bit of height. I hope you have a great rest of your day. Oh yeah, yeah. I mean, I already had thumbnails. I kind of cheated, but I have thumbnails. <laughs> that bas I basically just used. Um, I use the. I made because like I made that little picture from like the first day I streamed it. I took like the cover art and I just like put put a shitty uh, uh, like drecky head on the on the person. Um, now I'm. Why am I not getting as much hype? And I just did like part one through. I think I, I ended up being like six parts. Um, roughly about hour and a half on average. That's weird. I'm like, I thought I was doing better about the dash grab. There goes my hero. Watch him as he bloops. And I just slapped like a real quick like socials intro. Like uh, I didn't record any voice of like like and subscribe for the content. Uh, visit me on Twitch if y'all wanna watch it live. 
That's probably that's if I if I level up my my VOD game, that's probably what I need to do. But like even navigating the YouTube um, the YouTube upload system, it's just like what the fuck is this? The, the fuck is that? The fuck are you? The fuck am I? <laughs> yeah. Oh. I would say if I have one thing is I'm at least pretty good about consistency um, across everything, which is one advantage for how, when I when I built this when I settled on the handle of Direcky Wormer. It is fairly unique. It rolls off my tongue. As I've realized, some people, some people struggle bust a little bit. Ah! Now I just need to get enough height to get over that second one. Oh, for a second there I thought that got caught by auto moderator or something like that. <laughs> I'm like, oh right, things get highlighted when your handle is mentioned in Twitch chat. Why am I not getting all of that height? Okay, dude. I mean, I certainly don't expect I'm going to get much. Ah, oh, fuck, we almost made it. I imagine there's not going to be enough, like, actual traffic to the channel. It's mostly just as a storage place. But, it's like, it just seems like, unless you're already established, you're, when it comes to VODs, really, I don't think are going to get people. Because, like... A lot of independent people that are much more serious, like, they don't have, like, bonds, but- Oh, We made it, but... We didn't make it. You know, they have, like, a, an editor that they pay, and, like, the editor's, like... It's not even really a VOD, but it's more of a highlight. Yeah. Yeah, the highlight videos, that's what I'm thinking of. Like, highlight videos, little, like, 10 to 30 minute, um tend to be the sweet spot. That and shorts, but that's mostly just for quick, quick haha -ha funnies. Um, if you can, if you can finally, if you can manage to get in the algorithm with that. I mean, it's just like TikTok. I'm... Mm. All right. We're getting, we're getting a bit more consistent, but now we need to speed it up. Somehow. We need to speed it up, but we also need to get height. Ah! Here goes my hero. Watch her as she floats. Alright, let's try and get a little bit of height advantage. And in the end, we died anyway. <laughs> Yeah, it's more just having them on YouTube allows me to not have them locally. And I think... I don't know. That's another reason, like, I still want to keep them to make, like, maybe a highlight. Like, I feel like there's going to be a huge difference in making a highlight video versus just trimming it to be a VOD. Because, like, trimming it to be a VOD is simple, mostly cutting out, like, the little ad breaks and pauses. Little stuff. But, like, for a highlight video, you kind of need to have an eye for... What are the good moments to draw attention to? Um, and I know sometimes the way I think is 
a bit obtuse. So I, I'm not exactly confident in my ability to highlight my own stuff. Ah! Fuck me. Ah, oh, that looked like we were go. That looked like that looked like we could do it. Oh shit! Get the dash, jump, hit it, throw it back, dash, grab, bounce again. So this, this is such a tight timing because I need to I need to get there fast enough. I need to have enough height, and I need to execute the release dash grab release dash grab. Um, it's a it's certainly certainly the final boss of this area in execution. Oh boy. Coffee, give me strength. Yeah, and I mean, I would say also one advantage, like, I don't know, I like having the VODs because I can put them in like a, a Let's Play sort of playlist. And like, that was that was kind of the original impetus. Impetus. Why did I say that? Why did I, why did I emphasize that weird? My my biggest original impetus to, to streaming is Let's Plays. Um, some of the some of the people I used to watch don't really do it anymore. They were fairly niche in their let ah! and what they let's played anyway. I don't know if I could do the kind of let's plays they did that I enjoyed, but do I need to use that double dash? I've been trying to do just one dash, but maybe I need to maybe I need a double dash. Hmm. Yeah, I think I need a double dash. Whee! They see me floating. They're flying. Trying to catch me dashing dirty. Trying to catch me dashing dirty. Trying to catch me dashing dirty. Come on, come on, blocks. Blocks, blocks. All right. Um, Y'all have some ads coming up, so if you need to adjust volume, now you know. Okay. Mm. Not get it. Not get it. Doink, doink. Jump too early. I was not holding up. I need to hold up. Drecky, you gotta hold up. You may not like it, but this is peak jellyfish performance. So good. Um, any tips on editing fast? Yeah, I mean, I certainly would never say no to any. I just kind of, kind of fucking cowboyed it, but if 
you know of any resources or have any little things to keep an eye out on, I wouldn't say no to a bit of guidance. Oh, God, we're so close. close. You know what? It's faster if I do this to reset, to be honest. Yeah, that's certainly one thing, um... I do need to look into all of it as far as playback speed increase, because I did want to watch at like two or three times speed while scrubbing, but that ended up not working, so I ended up just being more of a quick drag and jumping to certain parts. It helps. I know for the Soma in particular, it helped a lot that like, it was fresh on my mind, you know? I just finished streaming the last of it, you know, um, it was only two session, two gaming sessions to get through it all, um, so like, a lot of the, a lot, ah! just because I'm talking about Soma doesn't mean it's okay for you to yeet me, Ray. You monster. How dare you? <laughs> but, uh, the fact, the fact that, uh, Soma was fresh on the mind, um, certainly helped me like jump around a lot faster. I know if I try to do anything that's like been taking up space in my hard drive for a while, might be a bit harder, especially the longer they collect dust. I would say one thing I noticed while, um, or one good thing, quote unquote good thing, um, from, from making, churning them into VODs, is it gave me a way to really listen to my listen to me on the recording because I don't generally review damn it my games too much but it certainly like across you know, all those 10 hours let me pick up on a few things I could be doing better at minimum um, making a more neutral breakpoint whenever I <laughs> have an ad break. Because <laughs> let me tell you what, making uh, making the transitions, cutting out like the ads, and then like trying to do like smooth transitions between them, kind of rough. Um. <laughs> Thankfully, I could do like, you know, a little fade to blacks, fade out of black, and it looks kind of natural, looks a little bit natural, but I feel like if I could have like a neutral position I could cut between, I could make it more of a, more of a seamless, more of a seamless cut. You know, Ray? Honestly, Ray, I'm being stubborn about this because... Um, where is it? Oh, I think it's turned on. Hold on. Um, is it save and quit? Where is it? There it is. So, um, I would highly recommend, you know, even if you're not good at platformers, if you want to play Celeste just for the story, because the story, 
The story is fantastic. The music is a great experience. Um, the game has inbuilt this assist mode. So you can give yourself an invincibility. You can have infinite stamina, stamina for climbing. Um, if there's a particular chapter that you're just having rough at, skip it entirely. Um, you don't have to get a mod or anything. The game is extremely accommodating um, to, to you. And like another one is like, um, you can give yourself multiple dashes. Um, so, yeah. Oh, I could have turned it on there. But yeah, yeah, that, that's all I was going to be, all I would point out is the assist mode for, for Celeste. Um, so like, I guess I technically could go to select screen, turn it on. Um, why was I zoom? Are you happy, Ray? <laughs> I probably shouldn't have zoomed in on my face while I was showing the assist mode because it has actual text, but <laughs> yeah. Um, but I like platformers, so like I wanted to give it a, an honest, honest thing. And also, like this is this is like extra hours. This isn't even like the main game is I want to say like six or seven chapters. This is like this isn't even this isn't even post game. This is post post game. Like um, when I mentioned I got to this, um, some of my friends who are Celeste veterans. Um, said, yeah, you should probably, you shouldn't go straight into Farewell. You should practice, um, in, uh, you should practice some of the stuff in the normal game or do, uh, uh, do the B-sides, um, before doing Farewell. <laughs> um, the B-sides are basically, like, so every chapter you can find a, like, a set tape in the level. And it basically unlocks a hard mode version of the level. Um, and then I think there's even Seasides, which is where the developer takes off all the gloves in uh, making the platforming hard. Yeah, because if I had if I had assist mode, I could turn on like fucking 50, 50 dashes and just dash straight up and <laughs> get all the way to that fucking key. But I am a strong independent snake who don't need no help. Brackets. He needs a lot of help. Oh god, this snake needs so much help. <laughs> oh, I keep barely missing that timing. But I don't know if I can double dash to get to it. Ah, I, my hand was not on the keyboard when I started. Why did I do that? Come on, Drecky. I wonder if I could get a little bit of extra height by doing a release dash grab right before the pink diamond and I bounce off the button. Let me try that. I got too much height. All right. Ah, yeah, I'm knocking that off. Y'all are y'all are getting a lot of mileage out of the uh, the void yeet. <laughs> what are you talking about, Ray? You're the only one who yeets me into the void. How could you do this to me? <laughs> you know, Ray, if if you didn't eat people into the void, maybe you wouldn't be in Dino Jail. He's so mean to me. So mean. Well, what's uh, what's that? What's that little clip that uh, that uh, machinery has? You're so mean to me. Shape, big, dumb, dumb idiot. Thank, 
Then I look at myself in the mirror and I'm like, dumb, dumb idiot. You're why I'm so insecure. <laughs> It's a lot funnier with her little, her little gummies. I am, I am not as cute as uh, Machinery's art. Granted, um, Machinery is the one that did my, uh, my follow alert. A little, little, little snack come up and go and blep. A neutral take. What about a four-wheel drive tank? I have driven a manual before, let me tell ya. I don't drive well. So, I don't know... I don't know exactly what you mean by a Chicago dog. When you call it a Chicago dog. What I will say is the superior hot dog is a pretzel dog. It is a hot dog with a buttered, like, pretzel um, bun swirling around it. It is fucking delicious. Uh, yeah. I, I've only ever had them way, 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 way long ago in, um, back when I was a hatchling and I still played hockey, there was an ice rink that had them, and it was the only place um, that had them for some reason. So if I ever find a place that serves pretzel dogs, I would uh, devour them. Another thing I do miss from being in the South is um, the kolachi, kolachis. Kolachis are my preferred breakfast, lunch, and dinner meal. However, the only place to correctly purchase kolaches is from a tiny little Vietnamese um, hole in the wall restaurant that's off like off the beaten path where the only person that speaks English is um, either one of their children that they have managing the cash register or for some reason the grandmother is the only one that knows um, English. And I, I know I'm being hyper-specific in this, but I swear I've been to like four or five completely geographically distinct, or not geographically, city distinct areas that all fit this description. And it's always the best place for me to get kolaches. Checks notes longer than a CVS receipt. <laughs> so a roll of toilet paper. <laughs> a Chicago dog is a... Uh, a Chicago style hot dog, Chicago dog, or a Chicago red hot is an all beef frankfurter with a uh, poppy seed bun originating from the city of Chicago, Illinois. The hot dog is topped with yellow mustard, chopped white onions, bright green sweet pickle relish, a dill pickle spear, tomato slices, or wedges, pickled sports peppers, a Friday capsaicum annuum, and a dash of celery salt. You know, that would probably sound better if I, if I could have, like, been looking right at my microphone. Because one thing I found is with my recent changes is, because I have, like, this box sound thing around my microphone now, if I'm looking right at it and speaking, I feel like the audio is very clean, but I, like, looking at my screen and speaking, it's kind of out of the side. You know, now that I think about it, I should have a, a Drekki read this redeem. Because I do like, I do like, I do like the sound of my own voice. And I do like dramatic reading. Ah! I will say, I do have a take on Chicago-style pizza, in that it's fucking shit. <laughs> I don't like Chicago-style pizza. I don't think deep dish is a pizza. It's a, 
it's a, it is the most inferior cake to exist. <laughs> I'm sorry, Ray. It's the facts, okay? I don't make the rules. I just enforce them. <laughs> because, Ray, oh, I almost made it that cycle. Ray, like, on one hand, you have this disgustingly tall pizza bread with, like, so much tomato sauce that the bottom bread gets soggy in leftovers. And then on the other hand, you can have curry pizza with tikka masala or that kind of jazz. Actually, you know what? I think I need a Korean pizza. Hey, Sokka's. Yeah, yeah, we hating, we hating on deep dish. It is the inferior um, pizza option. Ah! Oh, I'm so close to making the cycle. Okay. Ah! <clears throat> so close, so close. We don't listen, there is no deep dish slander. <laughs> Alright, you're talking to someone who's more of a my my ideal my ideal food is Korean food. Oh, thank you for the head pats, Ikari. Um I love me Bulgogi. I, I love the whole thing with like the variety of pickled sides with um with the food. I love um Bulgogi is a classic, it's very delicious. Um, I have also recently found um, Korean fried chicken, which is interesting. I believe I know what you mean by a Korean corn dog, and no, I have I do not. I actually have not had corn dogs in a very long time. But I would say my favorite. Um, if you've ever had them from the, the frozen frozen food sections, the breakfast corn dogs, where it's a breakfast sausage wrapped in a pancake, basically, and you dip that in some maple syrup, mmm, mmm, fantastic, delicious, amazing. Yeah, and also it helps that, like, um, gochujang, the uh, Korean red chili paste is like my ideal spiciness because like I'm not I'm not mayo is a spice white boy tier but I'm also not pass me the ghost pepper funky white boy um, tier um, I'm, I, I like I like a bit of spice now and then but it also needs to have flavor because like I don't like like, jalapenos is, like, a generally good, but I, I don't like the taste of jalapenos. Replace ketchup with gochujang. I... Mm, I don't think you can really exactly do that, simply because gochujang isn't... It lacks the sweetness of, of ketchup. It's a bit more on the spicy side. You would need you would need to have something else as a sweetness element. Ugh. Um, I mean, it's it's a balance, you know. Like, it's just like salt isn't bad. You need a variety of of flavors, and they all complement and accentuate each other. What I do need to grab is, um, I need, what is it, gochugaru. So, gochujang is the red chili paste, gochugaru is the red chili, like, powder. And apparently it actually has a distinctly different flavor profile than gochujang. Um, so I 
whenever I remember, I need to order some of that to give it a try. Probably in some risotto, because I'm, I like making risotto, and I need to get through all my rice. I have almost finished my 15 pound bag of rice. Hydrate? Okay. I will cons I will imbibe liquid. <sighs> now we're 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 getting we're getting to the second part pretty consistently, but I'm <sighs> That next part, I'm just not getting enough I'm like not getting to the cycle fast enough, and I don't know what I can do to get there faster. <laughs> That's pretty funny though. I could do that. I feel like I, I really I might have to figure out how to use the double dash. Ah. What the fuck? What the fuck am I doing? Drucky! What are you doing? Um, what was I? Something, something about food. There's something I wanted to say on food. Oh, right. Um, one thing I like using the gochujang for is a peanut butter curry. So, like, some creamy peanut butter, and, uh, like, half a cup of peanut butter, a quarter cup of gochujang, a little bit of water to kind of, uh, make it you know, thin it out a little bit. Um, very, very easy and quick um, sauce base. Oh. I wonder. Ah! Lobster roll is basically a sea hot dog. I guess? I don't really eat sushi very often. It's been a long time since I last ate sushi. Stretch? Alright, I'll get a stretch. Ugh. Ugh. Popping all them bones. Them bones, them bones. What you gonna do? What you gonna do when you pop them bones? I wonder if I can release it, dash straight across, come out, re-grab, throw back, dash grab. Hmm. Yeah, I gotta, I gotta throw it back. <laughs> One day, one day I'll have a dumpy, dumpy animated emote. I know exactly what I would provide someone as far as reference. But I might have to make it myself, so if I do, it's gonna look. It's gonna be of a quality, that's for sure. Actually, don't really. I yai 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 yai. I don't think that strategy is gonna work because the jellyfish is gonna get stuck on the left side. So if I get launched out, I will be jellyfishless. But uh, I don't. I don't really eat shellfish. And it's not because of like an allergy, it's more because they eat dirt. And uh, I would prefer that they stay in the water and they filter the water. 
eating all that dirt? Why can I never make that cycle? If I dash twice, I get too much height. Blech. It also doesn't help that I've shelled so many fucking shrimp. I don't want to shell any more shrimp. Please. Please. <laughs> Not the shrimp. There's so many. Oh, there's a skill issue, all right. Ah! They say insanity is doing the same thing over and over again. Thankfully, I can't read. Yeah, the see, I mean, if you saw, if you saw that Soma, Soma game. Uh, the sea is a scary, scary place, all right. You are correct. Uh, why have I shelled something short? Uh, I worked as a line cook for a few years. That was part of my duties, is food prep. Shelling shrimp and pounding meat. <laughs> the line cook life. <laughs> Anyway, like I was saying, shrimp is the fruit of the sea. You can barbecue it, broil it, broil it, bake it, saute it, days a shrimp kebab, shrimp krill, shrimp gumbo, pan fried, deep fried, stir fried. There's pineapple shrimp, lemon shrimp, coconut shrimp, pepper shrimp, shrimp soup. <laughs> And I, uh, I cannot wait to see my death count for this chapter, because it is going to be a number. Hopefully their integers can be stored as floats, because I'm not floating. Bet your life savings is at least five. You know, normally I would say no amount of risk is worth your life savings, but uh, I get the feeling that's uh, the risk on that investment is very low. I really, really, I want to do this. I want to be, I want to do this. I want to be a big serpent and solve this. But I might just have to say fuck it and take the L to my pride. Because I, it, it seems I'm, I'm, how dare you eat me. Like even I'm, I'm consistently getting to this section, but it's I'm like at a point where it's like I really don't know what I'm missing to be getting there. I mean I can, but it's more of like they're so far apart, and like on that section I really only have access to the one on the left. Maybe I don't even need it. Maybe I just need to be smart about how I throw it. Um. Hmm. I feel like this won't work, but it's something new to try. Ah! The 
uh, the release dash catch release. Certainly a. There goes my jellyfish. Watch how it bounces. <laughs> Force Dad Rock. <laughs> why? Why is it so true, though? <laughs> oh. I thought about maybe just using the, like, not even worrying about bouncing off of it, but I feel like I'm not going to get enough height because I can't just do enough of it. I feel like I've got to, I've got to somehow get a little bit more height. The only way I can think of that is with a third dash. Reset. All right. All right. Come on, Draggy. You hit that. You hit that. You missed the. You missed the cherry blossom. The cherry diamond. I'm a fool. So sad. Alexa, play Despacito. Oh yeah, the uh Um I wanna be the guy. The game, the movie, the game, the dude. I wanna be the guy, the game, the movie, the game. Yeah, if you, if you got a hint for me, I certainly am open to some advice. I'm doing it wrong. I'm doing it wrong. That's what you have for me? I'm doing it wrong? Listen, listen here, listen here. Shit. I'll get you. Ah! I shrank my jellyfish. Let's fix that. <laughs> 